Did you know that there may be up to 2 trillion planets in our galaxy alone? Almost every star in the sky has at least one planet orbiting it. In 1995, the first exoplanet, that is a planet orbiting a star other than our sun, was discovered, forever changing our place in the universe. To date, we've discovered thousands of worlds of all sizes and characteristics. A host of missions and telescopes have helped us to uncover these new worlds. The James Webb Space Telescope is the big hitter, soon to be probing the heavens and uncovering the secrets of a host of exoplanets. I can't wait for that one. Meanwhile, NASA's latest exoplanet hunter, TESS, launched in April of 2018 and on July 25th officially began its own mission to discover new planets. TESS stands for Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite. And as you may guess from the name, it is using the transit method to tease out new worlds. So what is the transit method? This was used to discover the first known exoplanet and looks for the tiny dip in light from a star when an object passes in front of it, usually a planet. The transit method and its variations have been pretty successful so far, and its astronomers have been able to discover some 2,916 worlds using it, although that number is growing all the time. TESS will scan the light from 200,000 of our nearest stars, looking for minute dips in light using four state-of-the-art, highly sensitive digital cameras. Here's to a successful survey of the universe, and I can't wait to see what TESS has for us. Thanks for watching Astrobiological, bringing you the universe plain human. Subscribe to this channel for more news, speculation, and videos exploring astrobiology, a science where biology and astronomy meet. See you next time.